I am here as the sun comes up once again, fishing a place I haven't been to since last year. I already had a fish on the first throw. There we go, yes. Oh man, this is a nice fish, guys, whatever this is. It's either a giant white bass or a buffalo. Oh my. Oh, it's a gar. Oh, he may get off. I may get lucky, it's a big old long nose, guys. Fairly decent. I'm gonna wear them down. They're yeah, real nice one actually. Not tired yet. Boy, well, he's gotta be. Oh, he's 30. Alright, I got a dilemma. I gotta go get gloves. Yeah, he is hooked. Well, so much for my grub. All right, guys, I'm gonna go get a good photo of this fish. All right, guys, about a 30 inch long nose. He made, no, he's about 36. He's three feet. Not bad at all. Well, I know it's not going to like that. Spotted bass, guys. Heck yeah. I'll take him. Little guy, but it's a uh, game fish. Big spotted bass. Holy shit. Got him. All right, got 
something here, guys. Oh, yeah. Come on, please don't be a drum. Anything but a drum. It's feeling like a drum or a channel cat. Hopefully a big channel, not a drum. Drum. God. Not a bad one though, I guess. Pretty big one. Probably five. <sighs> Oh yeah. Hey, he's actually staying on there, whatever it is. All right, guys, William's on something pretty decent here. She's using a big cut shad, so this may be a real big fish. We're hoping it's not a gar. Only other thing it would be is a channel cat or a flathead. It ain't fighting like a gar. Really? Oh, channel. He's nice, actually. It's pretty decent. I knew that's big. That's bigger than any of them I've caught out of here. Because I've never used Chad, though. Heck yeah, man. He's probably four. About four or five. Got a demon dragon and a... What was that? A Chad head? Oh... Uh, I think he's still got me hung. Every one I've caught has been two or three pounds. Of course, I'm using a worm though, but still. Yeah, there's, there's a big one sitting out there. Oh, this might not be a gar either. It's fighting like a white bass, actually. Yes, it is. Or a big spot, one of the two. Is it? Yes! Woo hoo hoo! Man, that's what I've been after all day, guys. That's a big one, too. Holy cow. Finally. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Finally. That is not bad. Holy crap. Here, I'm going to give this to you. No, this. Wowzers, guys. Finally, after a hundred casts, and losing about eight lures, including a crankbait, I finally got a big, he's probably about 15. It's actually really tall and fat though. The stripes just disappeared. The big and white bass though. Got him on a four inch Fat Albert with a six inch jig head, half ounce. Man, finally. Hey, I got what I came for. Maybe they just don't start real early in the morning, like at sunrise. I don't know though, I had, this might be in the one I had all the way to here earlier. <laughs> Not a bad fish. Pretty decent size, really. If it ever does. There we go. Spotted bass. Guys, spotted bass number two looks exactly like the one I caught earlier. Really dark, got black on his belly. Almost looks like a little mean mouth. 
Weird looking, man. He's actually brown instead of green. Looks like a mean mouth almost. It's not, but. There we go. All right. Probably a spotted, but it could be a white. No, oh, it's a big spot. Big spotted. Oh my. That is not bad. I'm telling you, these spotted bass down here, the lower ends of this river, look like mean mouth, but they're not. They're just, instead of green, they're gold. Very odd color. And it may just be the time of the year. Not really sure. They're cool looking though. Unique looking spot in that. All right, guys, that's my third spotted bass, the biggest one of the day. The ones that right now, I don't know what it is, but they got black gray cheeks and black dots along their white belly. And on the white grub. Not a bad fish. had another one. There's another fish sitting there for sure. Got him. Oh, this is a nice one, whatever this is. Oh my. Oh, this may be a buffalo. Oh my God, no, it's a bass and it's huge. Biggest one I've ever caught out of this river, guys. Oh my Lord. I cannot believe this. Oh my God. Holy cow. Oh my God. Whoa. Holy cow. Whoa. Oh my God. Woo. Oh. Holy crap. It's a seven pound bass. Oh my God. Whoo. Oh my Lord. Oh my God. Whew. Oh. Guys, I just caught the biggest bass I've ever caught out of this river system. Holy cow, that is a large mouth too. Oh my Lord. Very unexpected catch. I want to say he's about seven pounds. Oh my God. Look at that beast. The four inch white pearl tail. Oh. Woo. Now that's what I came for, guys. catch. That really turned my day around right there, that full moon bite. This is a very rare catch down here. He's actually only about six pounds, but that's a giant for this three. God. My Lord, look at that tank, guys. Now that is what it's about right there.
Boy, that really turned my day around. Oh my goodness. I cannot believe that just happened. The thing is, guys, you got a little bitty spot you can throw here. And it dies down, but then you walk away and it'll pick back up. And you just gotta keep throwing and throwing and throwing and throwing. And it eventually pays off. I've got the now I've caught the big white bass and the largemouth. Well guys, I'm gonna go try to catch some common carp. That largemouth and white bass really helped here, but as far as everything else, it just ain't that great. <laughs> 